is the only school that had both their girls and boys basketball teams make it to the state tournament last season. Both programs faced big challenges and players lost to graduation. For the boys, it's about replacing a six foot eight inch hole in the middle. Mandan's third place finish in the WDA tournament ended with another early exit in the state tournament. Their season ending along with the careers of a pair of double digit scores. They have to get used to playing without those big guys. You know, Elijah Klein, especially all state player. You know, Jackson Weiss was a three year starter. Um, you know, those two guys were keys to our, our team and now filling those roles. I think they're excited to, to get the opportunity. The Braves return without the size they're used to. These players know that and are ready for a shift in the way Mandan will play this season. Traditionally, Mandan's usually like a post, run through the post, but this year it might be more of a guard play. I mean, driving lanes, shooting, we'll see how it works out. We just gotta get, gotta get people open and we can shoot the ball. So, I mean, everyone's gonna be able to score, and, but defensively, we're gonna need to get into people and we're gonna need to shut them down a little bit, help our offense out in transition. That defensive speed is the key for Coach Schaefer, putting in that extra effort that has seen success across the WDA. Take a charge, dive on the floor. Um, we can't jog to sp spots, we can't slide, we gotta sprint. That's been a huge word for us is sprint and everyone's hustling. We need to play five guys together defensively. It's mainly hustling, like getting in the passing lanes, hustling. I mean, if you're hustling, you're going to play good defense, if, even if you're in the wrong spot. Mandan understands the standards with their program, but they are sick and tired of leaving the tournament empty-handed each year. I know the last few years we've been making it to state, but we've been losing in the first round. So obviously this year you want to do some more damage. So we ain't settling on just making state. We want to get to the state championship and Win it. In this conference, there's, it's full of great coaches, and the teams are, are stacked, you know, 1 through 11. It's going to be a tough, tough night, you know, every game. Mandan opens the season with the Bismarck Demons on December 15th.